For you have been in a season that has looked like a game of connect the dots. Over this past season, you have seen this and this and this event and this word and this thought and this outcome. And you have thought you could connect the dots and see the outcome. But I'm coming today, says the Lord, to say new, new, new. New experiences, new people, new adventures, new ministries, says the Lord. This is not coming, my daughter, as a corrective word, for you have brought delight to my heart, and it is a joy to come and lavish love upon you tonight. And I certainly am not saying it is a shortcoming. I am just coming to stretch your vision, says the Lord. Because you are going to go forth from time to time from this place. You're going to travel you're going to cross boundaries. You're going to get to California and other places. And I've got destinations and opportunities for you. I'm just coming tonight to tell you that you need to break out of the predictability that you could expect on your own strength. Because I'm coming to tell you I have good things for you, says the Lord. I'm going to use you in some evangelistic ways that you have not anticipated. I'm going to use you in some ways to reach into pockets of darkness and people's lives that you have not seen coming, says the Lord. And you're going to even rejoice. You're even at times going to call your friends and family and say, you're not going to believe what just happened. Because I'm going to use you in unexpected ways in the evangelistic outreach, says the Lord. I've got my hand on you to uphold your word, says the Lord. In fact, in the days to come, the words, the creative words of your heart and mouth are going to have power and impact and effect.